There you go. That's my good boy. Rodney Reamer is a hairstylist, so every night Mikey and Lucy reap the benefits. Lucy getting a belly rub. Right now he's easing back into work. 30 years of battling hepatitis C took its toll. I knew something was eventually going to happen to my liver. It just depended on when. It wasn't if, it was, it was going to be when. Scarring or fibrosis can be progressive. There is a risk of that person developing cancer. Four years ago, doctors diagnosed Rodney with liver cancer. Chemotherapy and transplant surgery wiped him out. When I went to the hospital, I figured I had his best a 50-50 shot of coming out. Rodney beat the odds, but doctors will still need to monitor his liver for the rest of his life. The conventional test is liver biopsy. It is safe. It can be done uh, under local anesthesia, uh, but it is an invasive test. Instead, Dr. Paul Thulabath is using a new non-invasive method to monitor scarring. The FibroScan works like an ultrasound. Doctors place the tip of a wand at a precise point on the patient's side. Sound waves measure the stiffness of the liver. The harder the liver, the more serious the scarring. After years of procedures, for Rodney, a no-needle option keeps him moving toward recovery. This is Marty Salt reporting.